also with like tax and stuff um america so. right now are actually doing they are getting rid of income tax and just upping the tax on like things that you pay in shops so everyone pays the same amount no matter what you can't you can't escape it you know what i mean so you keep all your wages but like i know toilet roll be a little bit more expensive but then that's for everyone you know what mm. i mean not just which makes more sense tax. because then regardless of what you earn you're going to be paying the same amount of tax the same I think and obviously I think is what yeah. needs to happen it's and then what about really yeah. poor people though well they won't pay anything it benefits them because if no but if they're like obviously if it gets more expensive they'll still struggle no no they won't because they won't be they won't be getting taxed yeah, but but then you what they earn. things in shops will be more expensive but then they'll be they'll get help they'll still continue to get help from the government do they get help from the government in america yeah do they yeah definitely yeah, I think we need to because it is a joke. It's a massive what topic. What am I paying tax for? It, all of it's crazy. I ain't paying tax. You fuck off. Yeah, all of it's crazy. But I mean, when it comes to the whole climate change with weather and stuff, I do think we are made to feel bad about it. But to be honest with you, oh, I know this is so controversial, but I just don't buy it. I don't buy. Th- I I believe that there is climate change. I do believe it, but I do think there's an element of it which is there to make you a consumer again and to capitalize off of yeah, it. Yeah, of course I do it believe is. that. Yeah. So I think we need to be a little bit cautious when it comes to Don't you think as well like the people at the top like they are actually soulless. Like imagine having all that money, all that power and you literally could control <laughs> like so many people's happiness and you just choose not to because you just want more money. Like you can't mm-hmm. spend all that money. I don't get it. Like what are you spending all that money on? Soon Give me I some, ha- I'll spend it all. Yeah, as soon as I have a Rolls Royce and a nice house, I can have the rest I'll of I'll be money. so good at spending money. Yeah, but billions. I it's literally proven that it's incredible. like almost impossible to spend a billion pounds. I, w- I know I would spend a billion, a hundred, <laughs> like I, I, a hundred billion even. I like. would fucking live <laughs> my life like there is no tomorrow. So you guys are soulless, just like the You're people. I just no, throw I money do, at I people. do good I at it, care. but I'd literally walk down the street and give people money. Yeah. Like I, I always say this. I think why can't like Jeff Bezos just? Oh, why can't I walk past him in the street and he turns around and be like, "Here you go, it's ten million. But to then, that, that him, that is nothing. But to me, I'd be like, "Oh my god." But then also, that's like the lottery in the sense of you're giving money to the wrong people who don't know what to do with it, and it can make them actually worse. But then also, that's a societal issue because then you've been grown up in an education system that teaches you how to deal with money incorrectly. Mm. I just know that I'd do so good with all that money, unless you go to private school. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> then you are taught how to deal with money correctly. We're not taught anything oh, not. about money. Oh, you're not. Oh, they need to start oh, teach people to. about. <laughs> Unless you go to Eton, they Eton, know how. Yeah, yeah. I think everyone just Thomas needs Moore to know about these things. We're literally taught the most pointless fucking things in school. It's ridiculous, but we need to know actual how to live. You're not taught how to live. Yeah, but that's the whole point, though. It don't, right. This is the whole point of the education system that we have. Right. It just it's there to serve a purpose of making you like a rat basically Mm. you basically learn what you need to learn you learn how to press buttons you learn how to do a job and stay in line you don't really learn much information that can take you anywhere you may go on to do further education with something you're interested in but realistically most people end up doing the job they don't don't want to do jobs that serve other people jobs that serve the bigger corporations Mm -hmm. you're basically made to be a clone of everybody else and then you go out and work and then once you're done working for 50 60 years you retire and then what have you got left of your life